Hey everybody, John Warden here again with another quick snake video on uh, the kinds of snakes that you might encounter here in Twelve Oaks. Uh, this one is an eastern rat snake, um, a lot of times called a black rat snake. And this is the usual suspect here in the neighborhood, by far the most commonly encountered snake species that we have around here. They turn up a lot in the common areas, uh, golf course, yards, um, several of the swimming pool this last week. Um, so they're, they're pretty common. Uh, as you can see, it's, it's a pretty good size snake. In fact, it's the, the largest snake you're going to encounter in this uh, area of the country. Um, this is a pretty good size adult. It's not uncommon to find these over five feet, up to six feet in the, in the area. So uh, they're definitely bigger than anything else that we have in here. Um, these snakes are harmless, non-venomous, beneficial animals. Uh, they can get a little feisty if you, if you pick them up sometimes. This one's pretty docile. Uh, but they can bite you, although it's, it's not anything serious. Um, from an identification standpoint, these are a little tricky because uh, the, the young rat snakes look nothing at all like the adults. They start out their life with a really striking pattern of brown or gray saddles uh, going over the, the length of the body. And then as time goes on, they eventually lose that pattern or almost completely lose that pattern and end up looking like this one here, at least in this part of the state. Um, you can see there's a, a little bit of white speckling that's uh, kind of a remainder of where pattern used to be on this snake. This is an older individual, so there's very little of it left. Um, but uh, this is kind of the general look for, for rat snakes in, the, in central and western North Carolina. Uh, these snakes are climbers. Uh, you'll find them in trees a lot. They get up underneath screen porches that are elevated. Um, they're attracted to bird's nests, even abandoned ones. So um, if you have those in your yard, you might end up uh, getting one of these snakes come poking around for the, the birds nests um, They eat uh, small mammals rodents birds and bird eggs uh, Unlike the other black snakes that we have in this in this area. They're not known to eat snakes um, So, you know, not not the copperhead eaters uh, like king snakes or the black racers are but still beneficial animals to have around um, So that's uh, that's pretty much it on um, Eastern rat snakes as you can see from uh, from underneath the chin there, there's a bright white color. A lot of the belly has uh, white on it also. So um, that's kind of one of the ways you can tell them apart from black racers, uh, which are similar in appearance, but a lot more slender and long. Uh, so if you see a large black snake with a white chin like that, uh, that's what you're looking at is an Eastern rat snake. So thanks for watching and uh, hopefully I'll have another snake for you again soon.